What's up guys, Harry here and welcome to episode 9 of Hybrid Domination. Um, I want to apologise to you guys because I didn't pop up a video uh, yesterday. Uh, my reasoning for that is because I had the whole week off uh, last week from school because it was half term and I was meant to do a load of homework and I had a load set and uh, typical me, I left it all to the last minute so I spent the entirety of yesterday uh, doing some homework which wasn't too nice. Um, if I could have, I would have loved to pop a video uh, but unfortunately I couldn't and I do apologise for that. I will try my best to pop a video every single day this week, even though I have got school. Uh, in the background at the moment, we've got some season matches, I do believe. I think if we win this game, then we've won Division 4. That would be quite good. Uh, we did a nice bit of skill, though, with Wally Sims taking past the keeper. I believe that's called the Elastico. I'm not too sure. Um, I'm really bad at my skill names. I can only pull a few off, and I don't know the names of them, so I'm really bad at that kind of stuff. But anyway, um, what else I want to talk about today is I won out 27HD's giveaway. Um, if any of you watch him, which you really should, uh, he's a top-class YouTuber. I'll leave a link to his channel in the description. Um, I won his giveaway which was of 1,200 Microsoft points. Basically what you have to do is guess the uh, minute which the first goal in the Merseyside derby would be scored. I guessed the 14th minute. I kind of forgot and even entered it. Um, but then he sent me a message yesterday saying you won. Um, I went and checked and sure enough Leighton Baines has scored an own goal in the 14th minute so I was like okay uh, this is pretty cool. He then sent me the code uh, just a few hours ago and don't worry I will be giving it away to you guys. Um, what happened just there I'm not too sure. I think I kind of got disconnected from Xbox Live but my Xbox was still like connected and everything. I'm, I'm really not too sure what happened there. It was nil nil in the 70th minute which is quite annoying. Uh, but anyway yeah as I was saying I will be giving away that 1,200 Microsoft points in the near future. Uh, something's coming up that will give me the opportunity to give it away. Anyway, back into here. Uh, we're going to play some... I think... Actually, no. I think we saw the team straight after this. As you see, you got a, a loss for the disconnect there. If we hadn't, we'd have uh, maintained a... I think I'm on a 1-2 to two ratio win at the moment, which is what I always want to try and um, get. I always want to try and win two games for every one I lose. We're going to go ahead and send the team to the trade pile. Uh, we've played quite a few games with them, and they were quite fun. They didn't quite live up to the expectation, uh, but still a very fun team to use, and I would recommend them. Anyway, uh, we're going to list them up, uh, most of them here for a profit. Uh, some of them didn't sell, as you can see here. I'm just checking out the prices. That's why it takes me a, a while to sell them. Uh, the reason I'm listing Andre Margins for a load is because there's only one other on the market at the time for 20000 start price in a 4.33. It was obvious mine wasn't going to sell, but I thought I might as well try. Uh, just see if we can get lucky. If we can, then that's a free like 10,000 coins, which I'm not going to say no to. Uh, Kelvin's price didn't end up rising. I, I hoped it would. Uh, but we listed him up for 50, uh, 56,000 coins in the hope that he would sell. Uh, Wallington here, gone for 104, you're going to try and get 150, uh, 157, 159 for him. Uh, Dabo, our right back, going to try and list him up for 6,500 coins. He's going to go for a bit more because he's in 442. Uh, Zalau, gone for 5,000 coins. That's about what he goes for. I list him up for quite an ambitious price. I list all my players up here for quite an ambitious price because whenever you do the first listing, it's always good to try and see if you can get an amazing deal on them. If you can, then fantastic. If not, no problem. Just list them again. Uh, something funny happened here. Uh, EA tried to fix their trade pile thing where uh, players wouldn't appear in the trade pile. And so they replaced all the all the players that have been missing uh, from my trade pile previously. And that's why they're all there. Uh, so that was a bit funny. Anyway, I uh, see some of the players I've missed there. The informs that were missing. Uh, Tarat, which I saw, was missing. Quite a few players. Uh, but as you can see, most of our team did not sell. So we had to go and relist them. I relisted them all for the same price just for an hour because I was going out for an hour. And I thought I might as well try my best to see if I can get any more deals on them. Um, I think we come back here and you see I list I actually dropped the price of a load of them. So they did sell. Uh, as you see here, most of them have dropped by about two or three thousand coins. Uh, but still turning decent profit on all of them, which I was happy with. Uh, the Wally Center ended up selling for 159,000. So that is about a 15,000 coin profit on him, which isn't that bad. We did a bit more trading here, trading with silvers. Uh, the main player I used was Sumahuru, the uh, Ivory Coast left wing in the Pro League. A really, really strong player. He's four star skills, so he's quite popular. I was picking him up for about 900 coins, uh, 700 to 900 coins, sitting him on for uh, 1,500 to 2,000 coins. And that's a really simple method. It didn't get me too many coins, uh, but it's pretty good uh, Pretty good for just, say, I only traded this for about uh, half an hour or so. I picked up all these silver players. Uh, silvers, uh, I've mentioned this in previous episodes, but I would recommend you trade with silver players. They are great to trade with. That is it for this episode. I hope you guys have enjoyed. Uh, if you did, leave a like. It would be great if we can get up to 50 likes, and I will see you guys next time.